Guys, welcome to today's um, 160 Alex video. Today we are doing an icon slash pop culture update. Now, um, the current trend that we've noticed is that we are getting bigger batches um, that are kind of spaced out a little bit more. So we had the November batch um, where we had that uh, really, um, we had that medium sized batch and then we kind of had that small batch that had didn't have very much at all. Then we kind of went all of December and then BAM on the 23rd of December we got this huge uh, batch of figures uh, coming through and then of course um, we have this month uh, where we've seen absolutely nothing. Um, now February is probably going to be similar to November where I think we're going to get a split shipment. Um, I'm predicting maybe this tomorrow even, maybe even as late as the 3rd. Um, I don't know if they will hold off um, another week or so, but um, I guess it just depends what's happening um, with the sorting and things. Uh, the reason why I say that is take this with a grain of salt, but the other thing we've been looking at in terms of um, the ETAs is last time in that December batch, there were absolutely no ETA updates. Um, Pop Culture just started whacking stuff up, um, and then about three, four days later, Icon went, yep, um, confirmed, had a full list, and then Pop Culture was sending out invoices and stuff. Um, we're thinking pop culture is going to do the same thing this time. Uh, they might actually start adding stuff to the website uh, before the um, ETA's update. Now, the reason we're speculating on this is purely on here, uh, where you can see inner quantity. So you have the shipper quantity and you have the inner quantity. Um, from what we've noticed, items that have the inner quantity update generally get put up before the ETA's update. Um, and so this is, I'm going to go through the list of what we're speculating is going to go in stock um, over the next few days. So we have the Mandalorian Sweet Bike, Captain Carter, um, Axe, the Black Widow from the 2021 Black Widow, uh, White Vision, Hunter of all people, um, the Armored Deadpool, Robin, the Test Mech Stark. I haven't checked the standard, but I believe the standard is like that as well. Um, now, these ones here, um, I think, are going to be in the later batch. So, these say returning, which means they already know what the inner quantity is. They're just uh, saying not a not applicable or not available because those items never got opened because they were deemed oh how dare we um have battery gate etc but the 28th of february is still saying for anakin and it's still saying for darth maul now the reason why i say this take this with a grain of salt um they know darth maul they opened it they inspected it they sent out those emails uh anakin they didn't even acknowledge that he was ever there um, that's the difference between Anakin and Maul. Um, if you had a Darth Maul, you would have been emailed and you would have been cancelled, etc. Um, Anakin, they didn't even tell you, but they had returned it. Um, now, the reason why I say this with a grain of salt is something as old as this Grogu release still doesn't have uh, an inner quantity, and it still hasn't had an ETA update. Uh, Vaughn, uh, Bo... Mando, obviously a bit newer now, Keel, uh, Winter Soldier as well. Um, one other thing, uh, you've got Silverhand and then you've got Batman. Uh, the Batman not updating is a weird thing for me as well. Um, just because you would have thought if they had sent Robin, they would have sent Batman. Um, the other thing is, is a lot of these were things that generally didn't sell well overseas. Uh, Captain Carter you can get for about 275 shipped from Toys Buying Agent. Um, she just didn't, didn't do so well. Um, so yeah, a lot of these, I feel, didn't have a large number of pre-orders, um, and that's the reason why they've been fast-tracked. Something like Bo Katan was very popular, and so therefore we're seeing a lot more being made, the production phase being slower, uh, because the number of batches is 
needing to be increased, uh, and therefore it's just taking longer to go through all the channels. Um, again, we're only speculating because this is what's happened in the past with this inner quantity number, um, and the reason why Icon put that inner quantity number is, is I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. Um, they're going to order a, ca a carton. They're going to get six shippers in that carton, which is just six um, Captain Carters. So each shipper is going to have one of these figures in it. Um, now, you're probably wondering, that's pretty self-explanatory. Why is it there? Because if you're buying trading cards, that inner quantity is going to be different. Um, so your shipper quantity is going to be 24. Uh, sorry, 24, 12. Your shipper quantity is 12 because there are 12 boxes to a case. Inside that case, there's going to be 24 booster packs. Um, so your inner quantity is going to be 12. Um, is going to be 24. Um, so that's the reason why they put it there. Just to let you know, you're ordering a carton of six. Inside that carton of six is going to be an inner shipper with one item in each of them. Uh, that's basically all that means, um, and it's just a formality. But as I said, these are the things that have um, rolled over. Um, just to show you what the Just Arrived section looks like at the moment, we can see that uh, Pop Culture did this really weird thing this afternoon uh, where they moved up a bunch of hot toys that had previously, we knew they didn't fulfill all the original pre-orders. Um, so these went to the top of the Just Arrived section, which makes me think they got a top-up of stock, and therefore there's definitely a batch in. Um, Echo rolled over. Um, so again, these figures were previously there. It's just not everybody got their pre-orders right away. Um, so the two Blurgs, uh, Boba on Throne, Norm, regular Boba, and then uh, Skywalker was quite late, and then we have these statues. Uh, so like I said, they were items that previously they couldn't fulfill all of the orders in the first shipment, and so now their second ship has arrived. Uh, whether or not these items here are all there um, is yet to be seen, but based on what we've observed in the past, um, we're pretty safe that our speculation uh, will probably become... Uh, fact quite soon. Anyway guys, that's the update. Um, we will post screenshots and stuff if they do come into stock. Um, a lot of these updates have been continuing throughout the day. Uh, mech test uh, went um, live just before the recording of this video, um, which is 7.45 Queensland time. Um, I'm hoping that it's uploaded by the time uh, the in-stock occurrences happen. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Um, again, I don't want to try and scaremonger and say you definitely need to order these figures or you're going to miss out. By no means are you going to miss out, I don't think. Uh, but, I mean, the 20% off using pennies on this bike is going to be a lot better uh, than waiting until Boxing Day or something. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, hopefully this helps and if anything else uh, updates after the recording of this video I'm just going to put it in the um, in the comments as an update